sometimes our memory fails us, we forget so quickly, I want Kenyans to get these figures right. In 2021, how many A's did we have? In 2021, we had 1,138 A's. What percentage was that? That was 0.14%. While in 2022, and I want you to get it right, because people have said that we produced so many A's that almost each and every candidate was getting an A. This is not so. This is all but propaganda coined by people who don't have proper intentions for our education system, people who I can call, these are the sadists. Because sincerely, when you start uh, maligning an education system which has passed all the integrity process, then we start wondering what your intentions are. The number that got A in 2022, which I met public, was 1,146. If you compare that, actually it was lower. The percentage of A's in 2021 were more than those ones in 2022. People saying that uh, Macho was given anybody an A, would I have been there to deny the Kenyans who got proper A's the opportunity for them to be awarded an A? That would have been most unfair to uh, me as cabinet secretary who has been bestowed this very important portfolio by His Excellency the President of the Republic of Kenya. This. There is no major change in the performance in 2022 compared to the last two years that warrants the social media outcry that we, we see. Each and every one of us comes from a community and we don't have to profile communities because the CS education comes from Kisinyamira and then you start profiling communities that 800 years came from where the CS comes from. I don't know how to call it, but the Kenyans, you can be able to see the kind of falsehood being propagated around. The truth of the matter is that where I come from, call it Nyanza region. If I was again to give you the figures of each and every count because we avoided giving ranking for very good reasons, saying the best student is so and so, the best uh, school, uh, the, the, the ranking as per counties. But then I want to give you just a glimpse of it and uh, to tell you that if ranking was to be done, where I come from, the best position they would have been is 36 among the counties. Where I come from, in Nyamira, because I'm put in Kisi and Nyamira, Nyamira would have been another almost four. Because in Nyanza region, the counties we have, the first count with the A's and even the number of students accessing university this year is Siaya County, which registered 72 A's in that county, followed by uh, Migori County, which had a, a total of Migori County. I want to give you the numbers because they will help you. Uh, and the figures don't, figures, they say don't do what? Figures don't lie. Migori County had 66 A's, followed closely by Kisumu County, which had 59 A's, and then followed by Kisi County, which had 50 A's. That is all the schools of that uh, county. Followed very closely by Mabei County, which had 47 counties. Yes. Nyamira was rushed with that one count, that one is what I'm telling you. When you look at one school, which was number one in this country for three, uh, uh, three, three years, uh, Mara? Maranda. Maranda School. The guy who left Maranda went to Nyambaria as the principal. So it is not a miracle, it's a, a question of a little bit of hard work. You have a proper manager, 
and is able to improve from 9 point something percent to 10 point something percent. And then people say, no, we expect that it is only such and such a school that should always be. Why don't you allow others? Today you are a bottom, tomorrow you are, you are up. And we are encouraging, we are, we are a bottom up. And that